Hello and welcome to the channel, YouTube World. I wanted to share something with you that was incredibly frustrating, and I finally got it working. So, you're using OBS, you're using an XLR mic, you're using an audio interface, and you're only getting sound in one ear. I upgraded from a USB microphone yesterday for the first time in my life, and I was like, why am I only getting sound in one ear when I'm playing back my microphone, but if I'm on YouTube or playing a game, I'm still getting sound out of both ears. So it's not like my earbuds just magically died. So take a look at that green bar underneath here. See how there's two of them going? Look what happens when I toggle off mono, which is like that by default. Look what just happened. You're only getting the left channel, which is that top green bar. Okay? So a lot of people were like, oh, no. All you need to do is go into your sound settings and go from two channel and drop it down to one channel. Correct. When you drop it down to one channel, you're only going to get one green bar instead of two, so sound will come in both your ears. The problem is, because I also play guitar and I like to plug in an instrument in input number two, if I'm loading up Bias Effects 2, for example, which is a guitar sound effects processor, I will not be able to activate my guitar because I've shut down in Windows the fact that I have a second channel. So that's like a crutch. doesn't fix your broken leg, but it helps you still get around. It gets the job done if you're not a musician, I suppose. You could just shut it down to one channel. Or you could simply tell it, hey, this is a mono instrument. So I'm going to walk you through this from the very, very beginning. Now that I kind of got to the point right off the hop, so you're here and you're like, oh my God, and you're panicking and you're on Windows 10, you want to right-click here, go to uh, Open Sound Settings. This thing will open up. What I do is I scroll down here, and I go to Sound Control Panel. Right? Then that's how I get that thing, this thing here. Right? So Sound Control Panel. You could probably type it in in the search. I just didn't bother doing that. So I'm using a Focusrite audio interface, uh, Scarlet Solo, for example. So, you know, you can take a look at this, go to your program, right? Go to advanced, go, okay, 24-bit, everything's good there, okay? Go to recording, go to your uh, focus, right? Or whatever it is you're using. And then when you go to properties, you go to advanced, right? This is where, uh, by default, it will be on two-channel. But the reason I'm having you go here is make sure it is on two-channel. This is also where if you don't care and you will never use a second input, fine. You can put it on one channel. I'm just showing you the different ways that you can get this to work. I highly recommend the two-channel one, 24-bit, whatever the highest setting is. So I'm already on that. Okay, now we can close all this. The magic number, or the magic setting rather, is going to your mic here in OBS and clicking on the cogwheel and going to Advanced Audio Properties. And again, by default, at least it was like this for me, this will be toggled off. Go to your microphone and make sure you tell it it's a mono, which will inadvertently force it to double up so that you get sound in both ears. Probably during this recording, as I toggled that on and off, you'll probably hear a difference. So that right there is your ticket to... Stereo, I guess you could say. It's not really stereo, but I guess it is. It's just doubling up the mono to go in both ears. And like I said, that's where the two bars are. And again, just to recap, when I uncheck mono, you see the two channels because you told it it's a two channel, but it's only going in the left ear. And again, if you go into the window sound control panel and you set it to one channel, you'll only have one bar. Therefore, you would have sound again in both ears, but then you wouldn't be able to use the second channel or however many channels your audio interface has. So again, this is incredibly important. And that's it. I just thought I would share that with people because I had one hell of a time and I couldn't for the life of me figure out how to get the sound to be in both ears, but without having to shut down additional features on my audio interface. If something can do four things and you're like, oh, just nuke these three and no, now it works. Well, yeah, but now you can't use any of the other stuff. So check the mono box on your mic and you should be good to go. So if you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't like the video, go ahead, give it a thumbs down. I'll make sure when you play the game or play the game, I'm so used to playing games and I'll make sure when you load up and you're trying to fix this, 
you actually get a panning. So it goes like constantly for the rest of your life. When people talk to you, it'll sound like you're going like this. This is what it's going to sound like for you every time you talk to people for the rest of your life. But if you want to subscribe to the channel, we could work something out. That would be great. I'll give you a nice full surround sound. But if not, thanks for stopping by anyways. Take care, boys and girls, or whatever it is you identify as. And as always, hopefully I'll see at least some of you in the next video. Bye now.